Humility is the key to spiritual success. Okay. You know, when you read 10 maxims again and again, again and again, there is a common theme, a great expectation. What is the great expectation which you see at the end of the book where Babaji Maharaj says, Om Santi, Santi, Santi. It only means that he has already put a sankalpa that having followed these ten maxims, you will have this Santi, Santi, Santi in your life. And what is the ultimate feature of this ultimate peace? In a state of peace, what do we feel? Utterly simple, you feel utterly pure and utterly humble. These are the characteristics of it. See? So each moment or the, each element of our practice, everything is are geared towards it. See? To establish simplicity and to establish purity. Because purity is the name of the game. If you read last message of Babaji Maharaj, suppose if you have to die tomorrow and you have to give a message to your dear and near ones, you'll be giving the best message ever, no? The ultimate thing. And you know what was his last message? He said, we are all brethren, connected intellectually, morally, and spiritually. This and that has gone now. There remains purity all along. That views the destiny of the being with the ultimate. A very powerful message. The first one talks of unity, that we are all brethren, connected, intellectually, morally, spiritually. We are all connected. This and that has gone now. Means you must drop your differences if you want to progress. And the final, it is the purity. When you drop all these differences. It is a purity that will view your destiny, the destiny of your being, of your soul, with the ultimate. It is a key statement, see. Now, when we gather the essence of ten maxims, simplicity, purity, right? Don't you think he has given a method also? He has given us a method how to come to this simplicity and purity. You just have to look at our cleaning process. What is the sankalpa we make when we clean ourselves? All complexities and impurities are going away. Then whatever is the rest of the process. But this fundamental sankalpa or a suggestion that we make. Now you think further, when complexities are going away, what will remain? Tell me, simplicity. When impurities are gone, what will remain? Purity, see? The method is there. We do the cleaning without seeing the possible outcome. We have not thought of it, see? The old man has thought before even he put this into whole thing into words. At times would come when you feel so complex, Complexity is the feeling, right? The impurity also is a feeling. So instead of using the words, may all these complexities and impurities go away. Try to feel that simplicity and purity, how they are coming forward. 